Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Zoffel try on for you. I ordered eight outfits. Three of them are bikinis and then the rest is lingerie. And I'll tell you what I think about them. So first outfit is a pink three piece set. So it's got the top, the bottoms, and the matching garter belt. So the top is like this. It has a little peak hole with the cups. It has no adjustability on the straps, but it does have the three eye hooks in the back. I didn't love the fit. Um, obviously I bought it because I thought it was cute, but the fit wasn't great. It comes with the matching G-string, which obviously that fits fine. Um, but the top was a little bit loose in the cups and it just overall didn't look like it fit properly and then here's the garter it's still really cute it's all lace it's got a little bow detail it does have the three eye hooks in the back and then these garter straps are adjustable and then they hook to the stockings but overall i didn't love it um yeah i didn't love it <laughs> The next one is actually even a little bit worse. So this one is a black romper. It's got lace on the top and then it's got lace down at the bottom. And it's kind of a silky, shiny material. But honestly, it looks like I'm wearing a paper bag. <laughs> I absolutely hate this one. This is probably my worst buy. I'm never gonna wear this. Uh, I think that um, Zoffel does allow returns where Shein doesn't, but I'm not gonna be bothered. Um, I'm just not gonna be bothered. It, it was a lesson learned and I won't buy stuff like this from them. Um, all of these outfits are size small. All the bikinis are also size small. And so far we're 0 and 2 because I didn't love, I didn't love those first two outfits. Two outfits. So next up is a black two piece set. It's completely lace and see through. The straps are adjustable, but there is nothing adjustable about the back. It is an elastic band. It's not super tight. And if you look, these cups are completely flat. There's no, give to them like well they're a little bit stretchy but there's no shape to them really they are just straight with underwire they are not very flattering it doesn't fit great in the back uh, this is another another miss um the bottoms however are cute i will give the bottoms some credit these are cute so it has little triangles here in the front little there you go little peak hole details it's lace and fringy. It's a thong. It's really cute. It's stretchy, so it fits really nice. It's not too tight. The lace is soft. I will give it that. I really like the softness of the lace. Some of it is really, really coarse and just not, not nice to wear. But overall, this set is not that flattering, and we will toss it in the pile of hates. <laughs> Next up is a couple of the bikinis. So here's where I will give them props. I really loved the bikinis for the most part. So this one is strapless. On the back it is crisscross, so you pull it as tight as you need it, so it fits perfectly. It has removable cups, so if you want a little padding, you got it. If you don't want it, you can take it out. The color is really nice. The quality is decent for the price. It's nothing fabulous, but it fits and it looks really cute and I really like it. So here's the bottoms. They are cheeky and red. There is a little lining in the front, not in the back, but overall very cute. And I will definitely wear this to the beach and for some photo shoots. That was a winner. I really liked that. I was really happy with that one. Um, and I was also really happy with the next one. So this one, these are made out of the exact same material obviously different colors and different styles. This one's turquoise. This bow, this tie in the front is just for decoration. You cannot adjust it. There's no adjustability in the back, but this one fits really nice. The bikinis fit so much better than the lingerie. 
And again, removable cups. So you've got the padding if you want it and you can take it out if you don't. So overall, super cute. The bottoms I think are identical bottoms or pretty darn close. So high-waisted, kind of cheeky lining in the front, stretchy and the material's kind of ribbed and it's the exact same as the red one. So super cute. I was really happy with these too. I was starting to feel a little bit bummed out about the order when I had so many that I didn't like, but the bathing suits were super cute. Actually, as I say that, next bathing suit. <laughs> the next one is another two piece. This one has the floral bottoms. These are silkier, more of like a bathing suit material. These are really, really nice, super comfortable. Um, they're high-waisted and cheeky, just like all of the other ones, except they're not ribbed. They are silky and really, really soft. The top, however, this knot in the front looks a little bit awkward. I don't know, maybe I can retie it and make it look cuter, but it just looks odd and like it shouldn't be there. Like it hangs too low and maybe needs to be cut or I don't know. But besides that, this top is really cute too. It has adjustable straps, no, no sort of adjustability in the back part, but it fits really, really good. And again, removable cups in case you want that padding. So I'm gonna try to maybe re-knot this or I don't know something, cause I feel like it can work. It's just not working quite right right now. So we'll see how that one goes. That one goes. And then I got two bodysuits. These are the exact same, just in different colors. So this one is in white. It's completely laced all the way down. It's got a little covering in the crotch. It is a halter, so it goes over your head and it is adjustable up here. This, this um, elastic band is really, really stretchy. So even though you adjust it as tight as it goes, it's still really, it just doesn't give you very much support because it's super loose. So. You can't adjust it and hope that it holds it up because it will still kind of fall down. And the back is the same. It's got three straps down the back, two of four, I guess, sorry. Two of them are adjustable. And then you've got the little triangle down below that's obviously just for decoration. So this one came to me with a little bit of seam coming undone. So again, quality kind of issue. I thought it was super cute. The next one is the exact same, but in a different color and it didn't come with the seam coming apart. So maybe I will sew that back up because it does look really cute on. I really like these ones. And then the next one is the peach. So it's not supposed to be sewn completely up, but it's supposed to go to here where this one is coming undone about an inch, maybe a little more than an inch. So. I will put a few stitches in that and see what happens. But yeah, overall, I was really happy with these two bodysuits. Again, really, really stretchy, elastic, so it doesn't offer great support if you're trying to pull it up or whatever. Like it's not gonna, it's not gonna hold, it's not gonna give you any cleavage or anything like that. But overall, really, really cute with these. So overall, minus the white one that had the quality issue, I really love the two bodysuits, and then I really love the two and a little bit bikinis. The rest of it was kind of a bust. It was a few dollars more per outfit. Like it was similar to Shein, except Shein, I think some of the stuff was like around $12. This was more around 14, 15. So at that price, I didn't love the quality. I know it's a cheaper, so I should expect cheaper quality, but comparing it to Shein, that's right in that same price point, I will definitely order from Shein again. And maybe I will just stick to ordering bikinis from Zoffel. But yeah, I didn't love it. I didn't love it. So I did put in another Shein order because I really love doing these try-ons and it works out because I use the lingerie for my modeling anyways. So stay tuned for that. That should be here next week. And in the meantime, I'm gonna be doing an OnlyFans update and Maybe a day in the life of or a closet walkthrough. I will show you all of my junk. You can see how organized or unorganized I am. And yeah, so stay tuned and thanks again for watching. And also don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And you can also find me on Instagram at Krista underscore T. 
and on OnlyFans, also at Krista underscore T, and both of those will be linked down below. Come and say hi, sub to my OnlyFans, or you know, check me out on Instagram. Anyways, thanks so much for watching, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye.